So going to the next trailer, which is the final and last trailer for this podcast, which is um the trailer for uh, the new movie, Wendy, which is coming out next year. So Wendy is just a movie just through the eyes of Wendy from Peter Pan. And looking at this trailer, I got kind of a uh, where the wild things are type vibe from. I haven't seen the movie, but just in the way it was shot, it kind of like put me in that mind frame of that's what it is. This is one of those movies where I don't think it's going to appeal to a lot of people. I can picture a lot of people looking at this trailer and being like, oh, yeah, this and that, blah, blah, blah. Because, I mean, it it really doesn't entail too much. Like, I don't know. I mean, Peter Pan was mentioned up in this trailer. I don't think Peter Pan is in this movie. Uh, you just got Wendy and the Lost Boys and all that stuff. Uh I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of confused, <laughs> you know, I, I'm, me, myself, personally, I don't know if this movie takes place after Peter Pan, maybe something happened to him, or before, but Peter Pan was mentioned by Whitney in the narration, so more than likely, Peter Pan had to exist at some point, but it doesn't have anything magical, everything seems more realistic, um, it doesn't take a whole fantasy type vibe to it. I know in part of the trailer, it is mentioned like uh, one of the kids is telling um, Wendy, like, we can fly this and that. She's like, for real, we can fly? And then the one, you see them jumping off the cliff and then the next scene is them underwater. So you don't see anything where they're flying or anything. You don't see Captain Hook or anything of that nature. More than likely, it's just... It's kind of like a realistic story of Peter Pan. Maybe Peter Pan is kind of like a um, a metaphor, you know, for never getting old. You know, maybe it was a tale of Peter Pan in the book. And so they just took it to their advantage. And I, I believe it was something to where maybe the island is... Maybe, I don't know, it's just, it's confusing, you know? Maybe it was just something to where the kids were on a boat with their parents and they got separated, the kids all went to this island. And so now to entertain themselves and, you know, kill time that they're sitting around, you know, just imagining things and playing and blah, 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 coming up with these stories and, you know, never grow old. We're never going to grow old. Maybe it's just something like that. I don't know. But, I mean, I don't know. I would have to see. Right now, the trailer don't really do anything for me. It doesn't really deliver anything that it was like, this is what this movie is about. Come see it. You know, it, it just, I don't know what to think about it. Maybe if I see another trailer, maybe it would give more, you know, more of a jolt to where, like, yeah, you need to come see this. But right now, it was like, eh, I I don't know. I, I, I may. I mean, I see. I, I see almost every movie, whether they look truly, really, really interesting to me or not. You know, I'll go see it because you never know what you'll like. You'll never know what you'll like. So I end up going to go see this. More than likely, I end up really liking it. I ain't gonna say I don't, I'm gonna love it. I'm not even gonna go that far. I'm gonna just say maybe I end up liking it. Who knows? Who knows?